just feel proper tight leaving in there like that, you know? Look, at the end of the day, Paul, he's a twat. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to drink himself into a grave just like his dad. You, outside now. Well, are you dead or just bloody stupid? I said now. I'm sorry, you're talking to me, ma'am. We're just shouting at me. Oh, don't play smart ass with me, sunshine. I've been to bloody London and back to find you. London? Did you see George? Yeah, I might have done. Oh, is he all right? I'll tell you on the way back. Oh, just bloody tell him, Denise. For Christ's sake, I didn't even see him. Oh, but I did have the pleasure of meeting his disgusting father. You had a lucky escape, if you ask me. You just made things a hundred times worse. Why couldn't you just stay in Rochdale where you belong? Just shut up and get outside. We need to leave now to get that last coach home. Yeah, I wouldn't want you to miss it, ma'am, so you best get going. Oh, Jesus Christ, Paul, what are you going to do? Stay in Wales and play caravan park with her? Oh, what's wrong with that? Piss off, Denise. He's staying, all right? Do you know, if you were my daughter, I'd be out to the room and out to the bloody door at the same time. <laughs> I'm done fighting with your mouth. You need to get a coat. You need a coat back to the rocks there. Paul, get your stuff. I have had enough of your bloody cheek. Do you know what you put me through this weekend? You know what? I'll just ring you a taxi to the coast and get you there faster, won't just I? Give over, Paul. I'm tired. We need to leave now. Norman's holding the last coach for us, and there's a storm coming. Man, listen to me. I filled the fridge back at home. It's gone to last you a good couple of weeks. Hey, if you can put your favourite cheese in there for you. Look, have a safe trip back. Come back! Please! Stop messing with